It's a Tuesday night. We thank you for watching. I'm Lauren Maloney. First at six, veterinarians are now involved in making sure dozens of animals are healthy after a raid at a Beekman Town shelter yesterday. The Clinton County Sheriff says many who were dogs were found in poor living conditions. ABC 22's Matt Lawfer with details. A gut-wrenching scene Monday. Crate after crate, dozens of dogs being removed from a business on Ashley Road. Yesterday at approximately 8.30, deputy sheriffs with the assistance of environmental conservation and with a great deal of assistance of volunteers from the SPCA, we executed a warrant on Ashley Road for a business. As a, as a result of the execution of that warrant, we seized 49 animals. Authorities say several tips from customers led them to investigate the business and ultimately seize the animals. We have a number of uh, ags and market uh, violations uh, that are involving uh, the dogs. I believe there's 25 uh, uh, counts of violation of the, uh, for the condition of the dogs, and then there's approximately 45 counts of charges for um, the facility itself and the condition uh, of that facility involving each of those um, dogs. Those dogs currently being housed at the Clinton County Jail. The animals are currently being housed here at the facility and one of our housing units that was, it's been vacant for some period of time. It allows us an opportunity to make sure that the veterinarian services that are volunteering to work with us have the appropriate space and time to enter, to go through and, and evaluate the animals and provide whatever medical treatment is necessary for the animals at that point in time. And then that'll help us categorize what can be done in the future. The SPCA is working with vets and volunteers to care for the animals. We are currently working on getting all of our all of the dogs fed, um, getting them healthy and well. We're working with a veterinarian to ensure that we are providing the proper health care to them. Um, with that being said, um, there are rising health care costs um, that we are looking for assistance with if you're if you're able to. Um, but we are happy to be helping these dogs in any way that we can. Can. Still so many unanswered questions. We'll certainly learn more in the coming days. Meanwhile, the Elmore SPCA is asking for help and donations. I've put a link to their website inside this story at mychamplainvalley.com. In Plattsburgh, Matt Lawfer, ABC 22 News.